I could not get that book, that story published. It, I was trying to make it one of the three. It is the story in the collection that was rejected the most. I was looking at a call for submissions and it was like, we want food related uh, stories. So food. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna write about somebody black. What's the blackest dessert I can think of? Peach cobbler, which is not the blackest dessert, by the way. I, I've, I've since been told, but that's what came to my mind, peach cobbler. Um, and then I had an old, old story that I'd written about a little girl who was like me, who was so literal that like God was in the clouds in the sky and like she could see God in the cloud formations. And she also thought the preacher in the pulpit every Sunday was also like he came down from the sky and, and preached. And so I brought those things together and I had this idea for a little girl who thinks that God is literally the pastor and that he comes to her house every week and eats her mother's peach cobbler, wink, wink. Um, <laughs> and so then that line came to me, uh, my mother made a peach cobbler so good it made God himself cheat on his wife. And like How to Make Love to a Physicist, again, I had my, my skeleton. Who's the mom? Who's the pastor? Who's the little girl? Um, why is the mother having her child privy to this affair. Um, and Peach Cobbler, I got so lucky. It's a great literary device. It's got textures, it's sticky, it's sweet, um, it's sensual, all of those things.